So this video is gonna get you back in your creative whoosh. If you've been feeling a little stuck or stagnant or like just not enough time to create all the things you dream of creating, this is gonna shift some stuff. Um, by the end of it, you're gonna feel like I can do anything. I haven't made you a video, or actually I've made videos. No, that's not true. I filmed videos, haven't edited anything. I've not uploaded to my channel for months and I'm so sorry. Quick update, I moved house. New back drop, do you like it? Um, I got a new camera. My other one broke and luckily I had a Best Buy warranty and I love you camera. I took that as a sign that new videos are coming through and I want to get, I know I've said this like a million times and you're probably like, yeah, I've heard this before, Laura. You're consistently inconsistent and that's okay. I hope it's okay. It's 3.33 right now. I meant to have left the house because I'm getting my hair cut. Look, it's really long, what do you think? This video is to help you go to your next level of creation and those times where you feel like, oh my goodness, uh, it just feels a little bit stuck, like I've honestly been feeling a little bit with videos. Now granted, I have moved house and there's been a lot going on. Why is it that videos and creativity are the first things to fall off when that happens? Because if you don't have enough energy and you don't feel your like fundamental support, it's very hard to create and it's like the least important thing on the scale of survival. Anyway, um, maybe I can take you to my haircut. Do you want to come? I'm so happy about it. Let's go out. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna take my camera out and about in New York City. All right, okay. Let's do this. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is um, the Grand Pyramid of Giza. Popping through here. Okay, enough. I didn't have the microphone on, did I? But at least I realized it. I was like, it's like the old days. It's like the return of the vlog. Ah. And then I said, I'm not gonna start daily vlogging again. But I might start vlog and content video combining cool like that. Does that sound cool? Does that just sound weird? And the light is all over the shop. Pretty much the same. Just very slightly shorter. Oh, someone put a cone here so that I could film, apparently. Actually, I wanted to get the flowers in the background, but you know what? I think this is pretty. What do you think? So I wanted to share with you a session that I did with my dear friend Kerry. Hey Kerry, she has a YouTube channel. You should subscribe. I will put the link in the description. Um, so she is a UHPer. She's in the process of being certified as a Universal Health Principles Practitioner. And we did a session two days ago and it was just so cool. We both were like wiggly dancey afterwards. And and I was like, I need to turn this into a video. So I asked her if I could share it with you and she said yes. So I'm gonna share with you the session that I did with Kerry. I would like you to follow along and basically it's gonna help to make some internal upgrades. So if there's any inner resistance to your next level of creation, creativity, and it's interesting you'll see as it connected to money um, and currency. So actually when we first got on the phone, I had to ask her some questions and it wanted to ask her about money and currency and she'd just come back from traveling and anyway let me let me tell you what happened so we started with fear of not being in the right current and that was linking to her weekly videos so she's just starting her weekly videos again as am I so we're going to be holding each other accountable we've got fear of not being in the right current linking to her weekly videos and then parallel to that we've got the moon linking to the currents of your life 
So it's interesting, we have currents, we have currency as in money, but then we also have the currents of everything that's happening, all the things we're creating. And it just looked like all these different aspects of currents. And then that is linking to your fingers and the way you are kind of conducting the currents of your life. So this aspect and that aspect, and obviously there's business, there's home, there's work, there's creation, there's rest. And they're all on different currents. They don't all happen on the same timing. And it just looked like playing an instrument. Then we have an image of your fingers being able to create reverb. So you know when you hear a piano and it plays and then there's a like sustained reverb or I guess if you were singing like a vibrato. And we have the phrase, I allow myself to create reverb on my currents whenever I want it. I allow myself to create reverb on my currents whenever I want it. So it's kind of like certain aspects that feel maybe more restricted or there's not enough space. It's like finding the space and the expansion and that like feeling of wholeness and reverb. Also looks like this maturity. Kind of like when you learn to play an instrument or to sing, you don't learn to do the sustained and the vibrato. That comes with practice, with maturity. And so it really looks like there's the kind of getting things done, creations, and then there's the ability to really have it feel expansive and full and luscious and deep. And that was linking to money currents, also having a maturity of expression and the rhythm of finances and we have the permission I allow the orchestration of my money to dance into the next octave I allow the orchestration of my money to dance into the next octave okay so we're gonna tap all this out together so just take nice deep breaths tap over your head and your heart so I'm gonna read the links again so we've got fear of not being in the right current linking to your weekly videos or whatever it is that you're creating, maybe it's your daily Instagram post, or whatever it is as an influencer, as a creator, as an entrepreneur that you are putting out to the world. And then we've got the moon linking to the currents in your life, and then your fingers, the way you use your fingers to create different currencies, like playing an instrument. Then we've got this image of your fingers floating on the currents, like rather than making it happen, it's like, oh, you just sense it and can create. It's almost like that feeling when creation happens from the inside out. Then we've got the permission, I allow myself to orchestrate reverb on my currents whenever I want it. I allow myself to orchestrate reverb on my currents whenever I want it. And this maturity, this rhythm, this vibrato or like sustained essence. And that is linking to your money currents. And again, this maturity, and then that's linking to the rhythm of your finances. I allow the orchestration of my money to dance into the next octave. I allow the orchestration of my money to dance into the next octave. I allow the orchestration of my money to dance into the next octave. Okay, so I'm getting that is good for me, for you, for this, for it right now. I want to know how you feel. Let me know, do you feel any different? Does it feel like there's more expansion or more freedom or more ability to create? Like there's a sense that, yeah, I can create more or just that ease of creation returning. Let me know, leave me a comment. Also, let me know what you would like to see. Okay, I'm gonna go join everyone taking pictures. Everyone is like Instagramming up a storm. And I hope that you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you are happy for videos to be back. Um, or if you didn't even know they weren't back. Hi, I'm Laura. Nice to meet you. Sorry, I should have introduced myself at the beginning. If you're new here, welcome. I hope you enjoyed this. Please give it a like and also subscribe to my channel if you are new here and definitely definitely leave me a comment let me know where in the world are you and what do you like to create and how you feel okay i will see you guys soon on instagram and i'll catch you in the next video till then remember you are the whole point
and connected, we make a whole new world. Bye. See you next time on Love TV. Bye.